too far up. Too far up. But this lighting looks so great. Oh my gosh. All of this one in. 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 Okay, so I actually just filmed this whole intro once already. And then it just stopped recording. We're just gonna keep rolling. Take two. What's up you guys? It's Alexis and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, are you gonna subscribe? I really, really hope so. <laughs> if you're new here, definitely subscribe and press the notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button so you are notified every time I post a video. Okay, so today's video is a hair video. Hoot hoot. I know I haven't done one in like a while. So I gotta get back to it and why not start with my updated wash and go routine. Now, if you have not seen my last wash and go routine, I will put it in the little i-card up above so you can click that after you watch this video. This routine hasn't changed that much. It only changed like a little bit. Oh wait, before we get started, can you guys do me a huge, huge favor? Can you guys vote for me in the curl kit competition so if you don't know what that is the curl kit is having a contest where anybody that's natural can post their pictures on their contest page and the picture that has the most likes will be the face of their curl kit curl kit <laughs> i would love to be the face of curl kit like if you know me personally, I've always said that I want to like model my natural hair. Like, how cool would that be, honestly, to like model your hair? So I will link the contest below, and all you have to do is click on that link, and then log in to your Facebook account through the link, and then search my name. But it should be on like the front page. Search my name, click my picture, like it, and that's it. Can you please spread the word and get people to like the picture because yeah I'll put the picture somewhere right here so you can see what it looks like so you know what to click on in case you forgot my name <laughs> by the time this is posted there will be about seven days so one week left of voting yes I joined the competition kind of late kind of late but I think we can still do it regardless so please spread the word and have all your family members your dad your mom your grandma your sister your aunt your cousin your cousin twice removed but back in the family again you know try to get everybody to vote your friends teachers you know your whole class please try to get everyone to vote and that would mean the world to me i will love you guys five ever okay let's go ahead and get started my hair is somewhat drying right now it's pretty damp i'm gonna spray it again because i like my hair to be like very saturated when I do my wash and goes. I love the way that mist feels. Like it's so refreshing. All right, so this isn't really a part of my routine normally, but I'm gonna try them anyway. At my school, if you don't know, if you're new here, I go to North Carolina A&T and they have natural hair expos here. So like people will be ambassadors for a natural hair brand. The one that I went to was Camille Rose Naturals. They gave me two samples and I'm gonna try them both out. One is a coconut water leave-in conditioner and the other is a butter gel. I'm going to use the butter gel towards the end because it's not enough for my hair, unfortunately. Right now I'm going to use this coconut water leave-in conditioner and I'm very interested in how this will work. There's not much, so I won't be able to use as much as I want to. It says that it's a concentrated leave-in treatment for shiny, silky, soft hair, which sounds great to me. So let's go ahead and try it. I'm going to open this. Oh my gosh. This smells so good. I like to pat it in first and then try. Wow, it actually is making my hair really soft. Oh, I wish I had more of this. And it like really does define your curls. Wow, I'm definitely on this too. This is really, really good product. I am really trying to 
squeeze as much as I can out of this little sample. So I think I did pretty good of stretching it throughout my hair. Now I'm going to section my hair off and get on to like the good stuff, like the main stuff. So I'm going to split my hair one side like this and then I do smaller sections throughout this side. I'm going to take the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie and it's like the classic. Everyone and their mama has this product. If you do not have it, I highly, highly recommend it. I highly recommend this product because it moisturizes my hair like to the gods. It's that moisturizing. So I'm just going to take a palm size and place this throughout my section. And this is also going to be a base for my hair. And I detangle as well when I apply this. Because I feel like even when my hair is just sitting normally, it will curl up on itself and I always have to detangle because the hair problems, you know? The next product that I'm using is a holy grail of mine and it is the Eco Styler Gel in the Argan Oil kind. This is what the product looks like and I'm going to apply this to the section. That is all I do and I just repeat that throughout my hair so I'm going to speed up this process for you guys so you don't have to watch me doing this for 20 minutes straight cuz nobody's trying to do that I'll fall asleep personally gel on this last section. I'm still going to use the Shea Moisture product, but instead of the Eco Solar Gel, I'm going to use this. So hopefully it works because can't take it back once I put it in. So <laughs> it's a cream. Oh my gosh. It's literally a cream consistency, which I was not expecting. Oh, y'all, this feels so good. Oh my gosh, whoa. And it feels so light. It doesn't feel as heavy as the Eco Style Gel. Basically my hair is completely saturated with either Shea Moisture, Eco Style Gel, and the Camille Rose Naturals Aloe Whipped Butter Gel. This is how my hair looks when it's fully saturated with product. Basically, I'm going to let this dry for about 10 minutes and then I'm going to use my blow dryer to blow dry the rest of my hair because it is nighttime and I don't like going to sleep with wet hair because I sleep too loud for that and my hair would probably get frizzy and be a cotton ball when I wake up. So to prevent that from happening, I use a blow dryer to dry. <laughs> So to do that, I use a blow dryer to blow dry the rest of my hair. After I blow dry my hair, I will show you guys what the final product looks like. <laughs> Like my curls aren't even dry and crunchy because as you can probably see I use a lot of the eco solar gel because I'm very heavy-handed 
but yeah so if you guys want to see how I actually stretch my hair because when I blow dry my hair I stretch it I mean I don't do nothing too complicated give this video a thumbs up if you liked it uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and press the notification bell that is right beside the subscribe button so you know you'll be notified when I post new videos also don't forget to vote for me in the curl kit contest I will have the link down below and what the picture looks like again so don't forget to vote for me and tell your friends your family you know everybody hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one bye